Good morning. Time to make the coffee. Today's flavor is hazelnut. It's 20 some degrees today, but it's going up to 41. So, and it's sunny. So hopefully it should be a nice day. Well, yesterday I did the grocery shopping for the month, and today I still have to put some things away. Um, pack some things up, freeze some things. What is the matter? What's the matter with my buddy? All we see is your tail. <laughs> what? I'm doing a video. I'm making a video. Do you have to go out again? <laughs> All right, let's go. We'll go on. Let's go. This is the third time they've been out in an hour. <laughs> Come on. Let's go do it. All right. Oh, this door is so hard to open. I really need a new door, too. All right, back to the coffee. So I have some things I need to put away. I have all these fruits and veggies. I spray them with vinegar and then I let them dry and put them in green bags. And then I have my bread that I need to pack up. So back to the coffee. I haven't had hazelnut in a while. Hazelnut was always my favorite, and I still like it, especially with the chocolate creamer. It's kind of like, um, oh, what do you call it? Nutella. I'm having Nutella. So this is just Aldi's coffee that I bought yesterday. So let's give it a taste. Cheers, nice and hot. Yes, very tasty. So my refrigerator has some more food in it, but it's not jam-packed full. I tried not to get too much food, just enough to get me through the month along with what I have. Uh, in my pantry and freezer. It was like a supplemental shopping just for fresh fruits and veggies and some things that I had to replace from the stockpile. So $83, not too much damage done. And then, uh, well, it was actually more than that because I spent $10 at uh, Flash Food on Markdown things and um, five dollars at the Dollar Tree. So, but still, well in budget. I set myself a hundred dollar budget for groceries, which if I spend it all is about $25 a week. I think that's reasonable. And hopefully I'll still have enough money left over that I can start squirreling some away for all the things that keep popping up because now it's my tires and the one tire keeps losing air and I had hoped to hold that off until springtime but I may just have to go ahead and put the tires on my Costco card and pay, pay them off so sometimes you gotta do what you gotta do alright well I'm going to go let my puppies in and enjoy my coffee, and I'll be back in a little bit, and we'll see what the day brings. Well, today I had a very lazy day. I spent it decluttering a few more magazines that I found. I've gotten rid of almost all the old magazines in my house now, and uh, I'm glad about that. So... That's basically what I did today. <laughs> I 
I did I decluttered magazines, which is nice. You know, I like to read magazines. I actually read them more than I do books. Oh, hello. Hello, buddy. <laughs> they think it's time for their T-R-E-A-T, -E but they're like an hour early. <laughs> oh, boy. <laughs> oh, no, no. I'm, I'm talking to the people. <laughs> no. No, it's not time yet. No, it's not. <laughs> okay, I give up. <laughs> I had the laziest day ever today. Um, I did declutter my little work area, my desk, and I did declutter some magazines. Too boring to share, but it was a very lazy day and also very relaxing and very pleasant. So for dinner tonight, this morning for breakfast, I had a very continental uh, breakfast. I had um, the ends of the bread that I bought yesterday. That's my favorite part. Um, like the crust and all I did was I put butter and finished up some of that Aldi's cheese that I had so that's gone and I had grapes with it so just fruit and cheese so it, it's sort of a European continental kind of breakfast so that's what I had this morning now tonight for dinner I still have a little tiny bit of this um, baked beans, just a very little bit. I'm going to finish that up. I'm going to have a salad. I'll finish this um, lettuce. And then I have these two stuffed peppers that I got from the freezer. I'll only eat one, but they're still delicious. So I'm having that for dinner. And then... I wanted to try this pepperoni before I freeze it all, and I'm going to put a little bit of that in my salad. So it's it's the plant-based by a field roast, and um, this is really delicious. It's really, really good. That's what it looks like. Mmm. It's really good. That will be going on salads and pizza. So I'm going to keep one out and I'm going to freeze the other four. Now I wish I had gotten more, you know, for 95 cents. But that'll last me a long time. So, yeah, I can't believe this is, um, net weight is five ounces and the regular price at Giant Eagle is seven dollars and forty nine cents that's highway robbery in my opinion but I think this will make a really good sandwich too on that rye bread okay I'm going to heat up my dinner I'm also grinding up eggshells here for the garden and I sort of have this dedicated little ninja blender because I have two of them so I keep this one just for eggs grinding up eggshells so I have a whole container of eggshells that I need to grind up yet now this one I ground up really really fine and I used, uh, I think, my spice blender for that. But the other one is coarser, which is perfectly fine for um, the garden. All right, I'm going to heat this up, and I'll be back. Okay, so here's my dinner for tonight. The beans, the stuffed peppers, and here I have a nice salad 
with pepperoni and olives and some mozzarella cheese and croutons and um, those french fried onions. So there it is. There's dinner for tonight. And I can't hit the button to take the picture because <laughs> my hands are full. All right, so that's dinner for tonight. I'm going to eat up. It's going to be a short video today because I was so lazy. But I will be back in a few minutes after I eat my dinner. Boy, even t today, even my hair is lazy. <laughs> yep, I was very lazy today and it felt really good. So, uh, yeah, there wasn't a whole lot going on. I didn't declutter anything worth showing you. I did do my uh, finances this morning. Um, I changed my sheet around a little bit and what I did was I um, wrote down the payers, the payees, in the order of the day of the month that I have to pay them because it makes it a little easier. So I did that, and uh, I did it for the debt that I owe, the debtor, I'm the debtor, yes, or am I the debtie? <laughs> anyway, I think I'm the debtor. Um, I did it for the, you know, what I have to pay off monthly, like the car and, and things like that. And then I also did it for the monthly bills that are just going to keep happening and happening and happening. So I have those two categories separate so that as I pay off my car and my Amazon um, and my Home Depot, um, I can write down what I paid and how much I still owe. So it's rather satisfying to see the debt going down and hopefully I'm not contributing more to it by buying more. So hopefully yesterday was my big spend day for the month and if you want to see what I bought head on over to yesterday's video where I did my haul. Uh, and I'm hoping that that tire will last a little longer. If not, I'll have to replace it. Um, and um, anyway, that's what I did with, with my new sheet. I, I put it in the order of the date that I pay the bill. That way it's a little easier to track. I was finding the other sheet, the original sheet that I had, um, I was just writing, you know, the bills down, and it. Uh, this is just easier. That way, every month I have a master sheet, and I make a copy, and uh, that goes in into the next month. And um, I didn't make like twelve copies of the master sheet because I want to try it out before um, I make more copies to see if I forgot anything or if I need to add anything or take anything away. So anyway, that was my exciting day. I did my, my budget. I decluttered magazines and papers off my table. There weren't a whole lot, but uh, and I drank coffee and I drank tea and I hung out with the puppies. So, all right, my friends, that's all I have for you today. I want to wish you abundant blessings. I love you guys. Be good to yourself. Be good to others. God bless you. And we'll see you next time. If you enjoyed this video, please subscribe, comment, and like. Thanks for watching!